Bell & Howell Film O Sound. It's a uh, H14 circuit that's been turned into an octo amp that's good for musical instruments. And I set up a Fluke 87.5 just on the plate, just to show where the plate's at. I'm in my kind of where I <laughs> fix things, and it's a pretty quiet amp. Um, there's some stuff going on, there's some fans and stuff, we've got a wet basement, but other than that, I'm just going to play some, some notes and a couple chords and see what this thing can kind of do. Um, this is a 6J7 preamp tube, these came with that, um, very powerful preamp tube, and I've put an octal into the slot here where the lamp was. And I took all the circuiting out for that lamp and the coils and other chokes and other stuff that were in there that didn't need to be in there. So I put basically a cathode follower preamp um, into this 6SL7, into the two tubes, uh, 6V6s and a 5Y3. And so you've got a little more versatility here. Um, and I love the tone just one knob. I, the way I circuit it, it brings out a lot of bass, a lot of treble, a lot of mids, and you don't lose all that circuiting through resistors and capacitors. So there's basically two capacitors in this circuit for the tone. So I'll just see what happens. a guitar I bought in uh, Jacksonville, Florida back in 1995 I think it was. $40. Uh, fix it up a little bit. Basically has one humbucker. That's a switch for the negative feedback, and that smooths out the circuit. So.
guitar was turned down. That's that, film of sound, 156 circuit, H14 turned into a jamming killer blues amp.